The Australian lamb industry has been more than 200 years in the making and has a reputation for producing some of the highest quality lamb available. After industry consultation, a change to the Australian lamb definition will proceed from the 1st of July 2019. The change will align with New Zealand's internationally accepted lamb definition. The Australian definition of lamb prior to the 1st of July 2019 is lamb means meat derived from a female castrated male or entire male ovine that shows no evidence of eruption of permanent incisor teeth. The new definition will be lamb means meat derived from an ovine animal that is under 12 months of age or does not have any permanent incisor teeth in wear. To identify lambs under 12 months of age, the NLIS uses an eight colour tag system that may be used to indicate the year of birth. Each colour designates a year on a rolling cycle, starting with the colour black and ending with sky blue and then returning to black. When born, lambs generally have no teeth. Within a week, the temporary or milk teeth erupt through the gum in the front lower jaw. By two months of age, all eight temporary incisors have usually erupted. As the animal ages, temporary incisors are replaced with permanent incisors. There is a wide variation in the time of this eruption, caused by differences in breed, strain and environment, and particularly nutrition. Therefore, there are variations in determining a sheep's age through dentition. There are eight incisor teeth, central, middle, lateral and corner all located on the front part of the lower jaw. The corresponding part of the upper jaw is a fibrous dental pad. When assessing dentition, it's important to differentiate between temporary incisor teeth and permanent incisor teeth. Temporary incisors are small with a pronounced outward curve and are generally more widely spaced than permanent incisor teeth. Permanent incisors are large and straight-sided how do you assess if permanent incisors are in wear? When the mouth is open, if none of the permanent incisors are above the level of the temporary incisors on either side, then the teeth are not in wear. The carcass will be classified as lamb. When the mouth is open, if one or more permanent incisors are above the level of the temporary incisors on either side, then the teeth are in wear the carcass will be classified as hogget or mutton. When the mouth is open, if one or more permanent incisors are in line with the level of the temporary incisors, then the teeth may be in wear. To confirm this, the jaw should be closed. If the incisors touch the upper pad, the incisors are in wear. Permanent incisors touching the upper pad when the mouth is closed are always considered to be in wear. Any broken or missing permanent incisors are assessed by closing the jaw and making a visual determination of whether these incisors would have touched the upper pad and therefore be in wear. The new lamb definition provides a more accurate measurement for producers and processors, aligning Australia with New Zealand, our major competitor in international markets. To find out more, visit osmeat.com.au for Osmeat language inquiries amic.org.au for processor inquiries or sheepproducers.com.au for producer, livestock and general industry inquiries.